work this land to raise my family. We were doing fine until last year, before the drilling rigs got here. For the country, so thanks very much, and thanks everyone for coming. You know, it's a, it's a. I don't know whether it's a crime or a shame. You'd say that we got to be here, protesting over water. Pollute my well and burn my soil. You raped the earth of gas and oil. I just want to start by acknowledging the traditional owners, the Larrakia people, who for thousands and thousands and thousands of years have solved problems like this with common sense and have looked after their resources, looked after their water, looked after the future generations. I was and beauty cared for the planet. and the air was clear. Well, what baseline oh, testing is, is here. that you, you test an area before a new activity starts. There is nothing, nothing in law stopping us from doing independent baseline testing ourselves. Headaches, blackouts and nosebleeds. Pump jack poison and all this greed. We want this map to be covered in orange. So that is why we are here, and that is why we must keep our voices strong. We must keep our voices strong, not just for us, but for our kids, our grandkids. We need to have the entire Northern Territory orange. No purples anywhere, painted orange. We lived our lives without fear. Before the drilling rigs got here Showed that for every 10 jobs created in the fracking industry They lost 8 jobs out of the service industry and 16 jobs out of the agricultural industries So for every 10 jobs they created in those local economies They lost 24 Darkness coming, I can't feel it in my bones Man comes with a pocket full of gold. Our most precious resource underpinning all environmental, social, health, cultural and economic existence is water. Without clean potable water, our many industries, including the pastoral, horticultural and tourist entities, cannot operate. Our cultural and many social activities will cease to exist. Our health both mental and physical, will deteriorate. I got mules to shoe and I got mouths to feed. A woman to hold and dirt to seed. It only takes one mishap to destroy the lives and jobs of thousands of Territorians. We have many options available to create a strong economy and thousands of jobs that do not involve risking our water, environment and our lives. Interested in saving the territory from fracking should buy the Northern Territory News. And we're still fighting it here today like We've had a green light when that green light should have been 10 red lights flashing and we've got a green light. No good getting around wearing gold rings and bloody big pocket full of money if we can't drink water. I suppose we'll have to import that from China. Like at our speakers to a conclusion. We're going to be showing Thomas some movies in March. Um, on March the 22nd in Darwin, so March the 23rd in Catherine, and March the 24th in the rural area. A 
and all the generations that have come. You know, we can't clean. think about what's going to happen just tomorrow or next year. We have to think Before about what's going to happen for the rest of eternity. Here.